Hi, Ron Thompson with Alpha USA. We're here to show you something very revolutionary in two respects. We have been manufacturing mag drills for about 30 or 40 years. Our company is about 100 years old in Germany, in Hockenheim, Germany, if you've ever been in that area. And we wanted to find a way of manufacturing a mag drill that would use a non-electric magnet. And we then went out and got four patents. We were awarded four patents uh, uh, in conjunction with a, or a joint venture with a company named MagLogix. And we were able to convert totally new magnetic technology to the base of a drill. What we're going to do today is show you the results of that. This drill is not yet on the market, but will be coming to market shortly. And you're going to see a lot of new features, advantages, and benefits that uh, uh, are totally new. What we do is we call the magnet our total material lifting technology. We use it on the bottom of the drill. And we also use it as lifting magnets, which is what we're also going to show you today. Uh, I'm going to turn it over to Ted Brooks, who's with MagLogix, and he's going to show you one of the interesting uses of the new drill. With the new Alpha Mag drill, using the TML technology, the MagLogix magnet, we're able to take numerous pounds out of the weight of the magnet. That's something I know you're going to appreciate as soon as you start to use it. We've actually developed basically a one-handed mag drill. Just wipe a little bit of debris off the bottom. Take this hardened steel, titanium nitride coated base magnet, extra durability, extra rigidity, Put it in place even on this 3 16 inch wall 2x2 two two square tube stock. Position it exactly where I want it. The magnet has a slight amount of residual magnetism even when it's turned off, which just helps me hold it in place by itself. Fantastic when you're working overhead, fantastic when you're working on vertical surfaces. Go ahead and turn it on. Hit the on button for the motor. Sometimes it's not technology that screws you up. Sometimes it's basic <laughs> physics. Lift that up a bit. We had to convert all mag or all alpha drills can be converted to be used as a magnetic jobber drill. So we forgot to position the the uh, motor back down on the slide. Okay, go ahead. Let's now we're more now we're set up for annular cutting. I know with most electromagnetic drill press you're used to, you're dealing with backup plates because thin metal just doesn't absorb the energy as well from the magnet. With this magnet, the thinnest metals, even down to eighth inch, quarter inch, are easily usable. The huge advantage of being able to leave the machine on there forever. The magnet's not going to turn off by itself. When I'm done, just push the little safety button in, lift the arm, and take this right off. 